Hello and welcome to the summer season of Bite Me, the cooking show where student hunger is solved. With fast, cheap and easy recipes for university student lifestyle. I'm your host Rohini. And I'm your host Marley. To start off the summer series, we're going to show you how to make a pizza bagel. So we all know that us university students love pizza, but it's not that quick and easy to make. The pizza bagel, however, is pretty much effortless and makes for a great tasting snack. And these pizza bagels cost under $10. Now for this recipe, we're only going to need a few ingredients. The bagels, of course. Tomato sauce. And cheese. Now that's really all the ingredients you're going to need to make a pizza bagel. So you do have options with additional toppings. You can add deli meats, or if you're feeling healthy, add some vegetables. Of course, that will cost more. The kitchen utensils you will need are simple. First off, we've got a cutting board, a knife, cheese grater, and a spoon. All right, so let's get started on this awesome recipe. First off, we're gonna start with the bagel. So if you don't have a sharp knife, you can easily just use scissors or just tear the bagel open. So the easiest and safest way to cut a bagel is to place it on a flat surface. Alrighty, so what we're gonna do first is that we're gonna cut down halfway through the bagel horizontally. And then we're gonna place it on its end and we're gonna finish cutting it all the way down. So next we're gonna spread a tablespoon of tomato sauce on each half of the bagel. One tablespoon should be enough for one half of the bagel. Yeah, Marley. <laughs> Look at you spread that tomato sauce. Now for the cheese, we've got a single block of mozzarella. Um, that's more than we need, so we might be left with some leftovers. And again, you can use whatever cheese you prefer. You can even mix it up with cheddar and mozzarella. Now the easiest way is to use a cheese grater. So Rohini, would you mind grating our cheese for us? Oh, I would love to, Marley. So the best way to grate cheese is to grate it on an angle for smooth grating. So once you've grated enough cheese... Awesome, thank you, Rohini. We can just so we can just grab it. a handful and yeah. we will spread the cheese on our bagels like so. Give it a good cover. Mm -hmm. And that's all there is to it. All that's left is to pop the pizza bagel in the microwave. Set it on high and leave it there for one to one and a half minutes. There you go. The whole process should take no more than a few minutes. Quick and simple, and you didn't even have to spend that much money. Now how about we let the students give them a try and see what they think. We are promoting fast, cheap, and easy recipes for students. And today we've got the pizza bagels, so go ahead and try it. So how do you like it? Oh, it's pretty good. It's good. It could use a little bit something else, more spicy. I could use a little more spice too, actually, yeah. I like spicy. It's good, I like the sauce. Yeah, I saw a happy face there. That was good. <laughs> it's really good. It tastes almost like a pizza without the pepperoni. It's pretty delicious. So I think you should have some store in Mac Hall where yeah. students <laughs> can have it or in some place, you know. Do you have anything else that we could add to this pizza bagel? If you're a fan of meat, you could probably add some pepperoni. I actually make this a lot, but I use um, whole grain. Okay, we got a pizza bagel pro right here. <laughs> if, if we can also do home delivery at a cheap price for students, that would also sound... <laughs> Thank you for the business ideas. I'll make my people call your people. <laughs> Well, that's our time for today. We hope you've enjoyed this episode of Bite Me and the Pizza Bagel. We've got some great recipes coming to you this summer. Fast, cheap, easy, and great recipes. Now, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and on Twitter. And subscribe to us on YouTube. Thanks for watching.